Good morning and welcome. And guess where we are? We are in Santa Fe at the Rail Runner Train Depot. Mel and I love to come up to Santa Fe on the Rail Runner because it's great girl time for us and the kids get to play. And also, the Rail Runner spans 100 miles. There are 14 stations, like all through um, Santa Fe down to Belen. Yes, and it's really, really user friendly. And so if you haven't had a chance to try the train yet, we really encourage you to just take a look at it. There's lots of stops all the way through Albuquerque. It's anywhere from $2 per zone all the way up to $10 to ride it for the whole day. And kids nine and under ride for free. So it's actually a really good deal. So, so now whenever you do decide that you want to take your trip, it's easy to get online, find the schedule and find the map that has all the stations on it. Um, and then after you decide when and where you're going to leave, it's like any other trip with your kids. You're going to be on the train for about an hour, so you need to bring things to do. Now, Melissa and I, we <laughs> bring flashcards and coloring books. Actually, Very constructive no. <laughs> activities. <laughs> we bring, uh, there's free Wi-Fi. Anything so with an device, eye. <laughs> iPad, iPhone, anything yes. like that for the kids, activities on the train. Um, also, I love that the kids can walk around the train, so they're not stuck in a seatbelt. They can go to the restroom, and you can bring yes. snacks and food for them, so it's super friendly for your kiddos. Absolutely. Now, once you get up here to Santa Fe, there's so many things that are within walking distance of the train depot. Our favorites are the, the farmer's market. It's on Tuesday and Saturday mornings, and I think it's the best farmer's market in the whole state. You can walk to a really fantastic park and playground that's just right around the corner from the train depot. And then there's, you can tour the rail yards, and there's great restaurants just within walking distance here as well. A couple of our favorites, Flying Star has Kids Eat Free on Thursday nights, so that's a great deal. Cool. And then our very, very favorite is Cowgirl, because Cowgirl has a playground in the back, and then they have really fun adult friendly food as well. So. Yes, it's our favorite because we can sit there and just have our girl time and the kids are entertained and it is. It's wonderful. It's fantastic. Food. So, yes. um, you know, also if you don't want to come up here and you're afraid you're going to get stuck at the depot, there are like 60 or 70 fr like free connections from the depot all over Santa Fe, like the museums and downtown, right. and even as far as like Taos. So yes. you can easily hop the train, get up here, and then get anywhere else that you want to go. Absolutely. And you know, I've taken a couple of mom trip, mom retreat weekends, where we parked our cars in Albuquerque, ride the train up, and then we call the resorts where we're going to stay, and they come get us. So you don't even have to feel like you have to drive or anything when you're up here. It makes it feel like you really got away somewhere fun and exotic. So, so awesome. If you haven't had the chance to try it yet, we hope this piques your interest and that you will give the Rail Runner a try. So for a recap of this and to get a schedule of the Rail Runner and maps where the stations are, you can go to casa.com. And we'll see you next Monday. Yes. Kids, are you ready? Yeah. Let's go. Oh, yeah.